All right, guys, I'm going to start this one a little different from normal. Uh, 93 acres, Harrelson County. Uh, I'm in a strategic spot, so I thought I'd take advantage of it. Basically, um, we are looking at uh, 93 acres, pasture in the front, and you've got Highway 120 here. And so this is the road frontage for the uh, property. And right across the street, you've got Harrelson High School. So I thought uh, the property is about the other side of where that drive is up to the school. So the line is down there. You've got this front pasture here. And uh, we've got a little, uh, here's your drive and gate into the property here. Got the farm gate here. This has been a, this is a working cattle ranch right now. There's actually some lease income associated with it if you want to keep the cattle lease or it could be canceled. This is an old historic, uh, the owners have had this place for generations and say so that was, uh, actually has been there for, for years. The uh, lady said when she was in the fourth grade, she remembers that structure. Uh, looks like it might still be used for uh, storage and such. But uh, and then we've got a little cattle pen area here. The pasture here, some very nice mature trees. As you can see, this, this joins the neighbor, um, and uh, the cattle just kind of freely roam right now. But, but again, somebody could put up a fence and cancel the lease. And then it really goes, it's really a nice view here. This, uh, this goes, all those big trees in the back, as far as you can see, that's on the property. It goes straight north, and actually there's a little sliver. It's right along the line of the big trees way in the distance. A little sliver of pine up there is actually on the property, so all those trees in the distance on the 93 acres. Let's get in the vehicle and take a little bit better and get around a little faster. But uh, highway, 120, highway 120 frontage right across from Harrelson High School, 93 acres. Now you'll note on the website, of course, that uh, one can add or purchase a larger tract of 185 acres, which would include all of this plus a brick home and an, an additional 92.5 acres uh, to the east. Now this property also has uh, named, you're looking uh, in the distance there, <coughs> is uh, Beach Creek. That is uh, about a quarter of a mile on the 93 acres. Again, if one were to add, the and I'm, I'm kind of panning toward the 92 right now, this is going to be on the uh, on this particular 93 acres here, this pasture, and then running up that hill, you can clearly see up there, right to the edge of those big trees. There's a, a thin sliver of pine that actually is on the property. Uh, so this is the 93 acre piece, which is next door to a 92.5 that's available with that house. Uh, the fence line is not these trees, but the next trees over. So all that pasture. The second set of trees there, uh, that's the fence line, so it's separating the two. So uh, all this pasture here, established pasture, is uh, on the 93 acres. Uh, so we've got a 93 acre land only option, and uh, if you want a bigger footprint and a home, uh, 92.5, and all this is on the website so you can see uh, the uh, differences in the two properties. So. Again, that, 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 fin that little bit of pasture there, there's a little spring branch you see right here. That's on the 93 acres. There's a little bit of a pasture and there's a fence, so that would separate the two. So this is all on the uh, 93 acres here. Little spring branch, pasture, and we're going to go down to the Big Creek. All right, guys, continuing to roll. Uh, of course, again, up the hill there, that's the road frontage. All this is the pasture on the front end here. Uh, nice spring branch running right here. Pretty little spring branch. And then uh, that pasture right there, and this is on the 93. You see up there, there's that little training pen or cattle pen we, we looked at earlier. So, of course, all this will green up, you know, in the uh, in the spring and summertime, of course. Let me get down to the Big Creek. I 
actually I can get a little closer if I just cross this. Yeah, it's looking back toward the road. You can even see the uh, sports lights for the uh, high school across the street. Here we're crossing the little spring branch. Here's your spring branch here. Feeding into, this is just a little spring branch feeder. Uh, feeding into Beach Creek over here. Let's get out in this corner here. Pasture. That'd be the fence line for the 93. That'd be your uh, eastern border over there. And then here's the big Beach Creek. Again, we're downstream here from the Gold Prospector's lease, uh, which is just upstream there. And, of course, if you bought the 185, you'd have about a half mile of this, uh, this creek, and uh, about a quarter mile here with the 93 acres, about a quarter mile here of this creek, both sides. And then you've got pasture on the 93 acres. You can see the pasture on the other side that... Uh, We'll have some video of that a little bit later. And then the big trees all the way to the north. All right, guys, we're, uh, you know, roughly, and again, this is not cast in stone, but we all are offering, again, the 185, which would be this pasture on the other side of the creek. Now, there's pasture behind, directly behind the house. Here you've got Beach Creek, and then you've got this pasture here. We're roughly where we're thinking the uh, line would be if someone were to, uh, you know, elect to go with the 92.5. Uh, in other words, there'd be a northern line cutting up there through the trees. And again, those big trees, if you look at the map, they go for a long way to the north. Um, so the 92.5 would have roughly this pasture here. And, of course, the 185 would continue and have all this pasture here. So, um, you know, you can call me for questions on the uh, division that we're talking about. But, uh, and I can point that out while you're looking at the map. But, uh Anyway, so this would be the pasture, uh, continued pasture, if one had the, uh, the 185 acres. And then the beautiful Beach Creek there down below. All right, guys, so as you know, we're offering this as a 185-acre track, um, about 92.5 with the house and or about 93 without the house. I am currently on the uh, other side of Beach Creek and on what would be the new eastern boundary roughly uh, for the uh, uh, 93 acres so here you've got about a quarter of a mile here of beach creek and all this pasture here on the 93 acre side again the big trees in the distance uh, go considerably uh, north of the property and uh, Again, you can see a lot of detail on the map, uh, and you know. We, so we got three pieces here: the 185. There's about 91,000 value, uh, 91,000 dollars of uh, timber value um, on the uh, complete package. And again, all that's all kind of prorated if you were to buy the track. And I think you can see Beach Creek in the distance there, so I thought I'd, I'd run the creek here a little bit. And so this pasture here would be on the 92 acre piece or 93 acre piece. Uh, so there's a land only option. And, uh, you know, of course, the complete package. Let's see here, I'm right. Able to kind of look down on the creek from the road. There we go, Beach Creek. Pasture, big timber. All right, guys, this is on the land only side. Or the, you know, again, if you had the whole one, 185. So 93 acres, Harrelson County, right on 120, right across from Harrelson High School. Uh, you've got, uh, so you've got 120 road frontage. You've got pasture. You've got big trees in the back with timber value. Check the website. Uh, you can also add 92.5 acres with the brick home. All this is on the website. And uh, if you'd like to take a look at this beautiful property called Don Ellers, Land Crawler. 770-424-5800.